This is problem 443. And what we're looking for in this problem is the Thevenin equivalent, Thevenin equivalent, looking into the terminals A and B. So here, and then we also want to solve for Ix. So two things, Thevenin equivalent and Ix. So let's solve this problem. Okay, the first step to finding the Thevenin equivalent is to turn off all independent sources. So turn off this 20 volts, turn off the two amps. So turning that off, we have a short circuit here and then we have this resistor and we're looking for A to B and this becomes an open circuit that becomes open and so we have 5 ohms here and we have 10 ohms here and 10 ohms here. Now between A and B we are looking for the Thevenin resistance. Now 10 and 10 are in parallel, are in parallel, so adding those together we have 10 times 10 divided by 10 plus 10 and that is 100 divided by 20 which then comes out to 5 ohms, 5 ohms combining these two and then we have when we combine those two, then it is in series with this resistor, 5. So we have plus another 5. So the total Thevenin resistance is 10 ohms. 10 ohms. Okay. So we have found the Thevenin resistance. Now let's find the Thevenin voltage. So we turn back on the voltage sources. So let's draw the circuit. We have 20 volts and 10, 10, and there's a resistor there. And then we have our two amps here. And this resistance is 5 ohms. This resistance is 10 ohms. And this resistance is 10 ohms. And we're looking for the voltage here. The voltage from A to B. We're looking for this voltage across here. Okay. So to find that voltage... Let's talk about what the voltage is right at this point, right at B. Well, if we know that this is 2 amps, and 2 amps comes down here, so if we say this is our reference, 0 volts, then this must be 2 times 5. This must be 10 volts up here at B. And 20 volts over here, we have a voltage divider, so we can do 10 over 10 plus 10 times 20 will be the voltage here at A, the voltage at A, which comes out to 10 volts. So the voltage across A to B is zero volts. So Voltage at A minus the voltage at B equals 10 minus 10, which is 0 volts. 0 volts. So that is our Thevenin voltage here. 0 volts. So let's draw this circuit one more time. So what we have is nothing more than a 0 volt power supply voltage source in series with a 10 ohm resistor 
And in this problem, it wants us to find Ix, Ix here with this six ohm resistor in here. So if this is six, this is A and B, this is six ohms, it wants us to find this I. Well, if we have zero volts here, I is equal to zero. Okay. So this is our solution for the problem for 43.